Hola, my friends. Hope all of you are doing well. Welcome back to my Southern Kitchen. My name is Ellen. Cinco de Mayo is right around the corner, and today I've got a great recipe for y'all. I am a diehard fan of cornbread, so I'm going to share with all of y'all a Mexican-style cornbread. And my friends, it is so simple and easy to make. The bomb.com delicious is going to be full of jalapenos, cheese, and corn. Mm-mm. Oh, my mouth's watering. Everybody's going to love and enjoy this. And it would be great to serve with your chicken tortilla soup, chili, and more. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. Also, check out my previous video, 8th Flavor Pound Cake. I'll post a link to that down below in the description box. So grab your cornmeal, your cheese, and get those jalapenos diced in sugar because we're about to bake some Mexican cornbread magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go! All right, my friends, the first step we're going to do is prep up our dry ingredients. Over here, I have my self-rising yellow cornmeal mix. We need one cup. And we're going to fluff it up just like we do flour. And we're going to level it off. And voila, perfect cup. And we're going to pour it into my sifter and medium bowl. And now we need a half a cup of self-rising flour. Going to fluff it up. And level it off. And the perfect half a cup. And if you don't have self-rising flour or self-rising cornmeal, just use regular cornmeal and all-purpose flour. Just add in two teaspoons of baking powder and a half a teaspoon of salt. And then to our flour and cornmeal, we're going to add in a third of a cup of white sugar to give our cornbread a little sweetness. And a half a teaspoon of baking soda. And we're going to sift these all together. Or you can whisk them if you like. Alrighty, so now we're going to set the dry ingredients aside while we work on the wet ingredients. In our large bowl, we're going to add in two extra large eggs at room temperature. And one of my eggs had a double yolk. Next, we're going to add in a fourth of a cup of applesauce. One 14.75 ounce can of cream style corn. One cup of shredded Mexican blend cheese. Two fresh jalapeno peppers that I diced and I removed the seeds. And one cup of buttermilk at room temperature and whisk all together until they're well blended. All right, my friends, now we're gonna slowly add in the dry ingredients. And whisk until everything is well combined and be careful not to over mix. All right, my friends, and just that quickly, our cornbread batter is complete. Look how nice and smooth that is. Excellent. And look at the specks of jalapenos and the cream corn. So now we are ready to pour the batter into our pan. We're going to pour it in the 8 by 8 inch square baking pan that I sprayed with cooking spray. All right, and there's one more thing we got to add to it. A half a cup of the Mexican blend cheese. Going to sprinkle it right on top. So that's a total of one and a half cups of shredded cheese in the entire recipe. Now we are ready to put this cornbread in the oven. Oven's preheated to 350 degrees. We're going to let it bake for about 35 minutes. And I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, there you have it. Mexican cornbread. Don't that look good? I just taken it out of the oven. Mm, and it smells heavenly up in this kitchen. It's nice and golden brown. And you see the cheese has melted on top. So now I'm going to let it rest for about 10 minutes. And then I'll fix me up a plate. And then we'll give it a taste. All 
All right, my friends, I've got my plate ready and I'm serving mine with a nice pat of butter. Oh yes, nothing like cornbread and butter. Now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Spread my butter a little bit. And look at this texture. Nice and moist. Mm-mm. Look at that. Have a bite. Mmm. It just melts in your mouth. I love that cake from the jalapeno. And I can taste the cream corn. Super flavorful. This Mexican cornbread is phenomenal, my friends. Please give this recipe a try. This deserves another bite. Mm-mm. Yum o. Oh. Mexican cornbread licious. My friends, I want to thank all y'all for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. Also, follow me on social media, Facebook, Ellen's Homemade Delights, and Instagram at Ellen Delights. And don't forget to hashtag Ellen's Homemade Delights. And please send me an email, Ellen's Homemade Delights at gmail.com. I would love to see your beautiful creations with my recipes. And I'll see y'all on my next video. Let's eat, much love, and happy Cinco de Mayo.